Welcome back to Game Plan. Lo Galindo here with Augie Garrido. Can't get enough of fundamentals, so we'll go back to them with the best of fundamentals this season. Once you get the jump on the ball and the ball's in the air, it's all about a mentality. You can't make a great play if you don't try. There are three keys to being able to handle the hot corner. One is always being alert. Two is being able to field the ball cleanly. And three, making sure you're going to be prepared to make a strong and accurate throw. The next grip that I kind of came up with was your fingers off to the left hand side, splitting that seam. This is probably the nastiest sinker you can throw, I think. So caution, watch out with throwing this. Barry hits the ball to me. I'm coming up charging hard, staying under control, feeling it, throwing the ball right at the tough man's head. The first step to fitting the position on the mound, period, is just being in a ready position after you deliver the pitch. You're not always going to have time to get up. Wait back, wait back, let the ball travel, come back, make sure your arm's good, make sure your shoulder's still on track for second base. Finish, make sure your weight comes through, make sure that right leg comes up. So when the ball's hit and you get your jump, the first thing that you think, no matter where it's hit, is that I'm catching that baseball. When you feel the ball, you feel it on your left side, go up straight towards first base, and make a good strong throw to first base. If you're lucky enough to catch the ball cleanly in your glove when it's hit right back at you, there's no need to rush it. The runner has barely got out of the box. You want to take kind of like a banana turn, so you get right here so you can have your momentum going straight to the bag. The key with no matter what the grip is, is we're looking for movement, not just from left to right, but also um, going downwards too. And when you get to the ball, you want to field it and try to plant your back foot. Plant it, feel the ball, and make a good step and throw. Now, if the ball is already rolling whenever it comes off the bat and you field it, field it with your glove already with your bat towards home plate, so that way, again, you can have one shuffle and have your momentum already moving towards first base now when you make the throw. After you make the great play, get up, smile, throw it into the infielder and the crowd's usually going crazy and it's pretty cool. And my uh, third you know, key to fundamentals is swing hard in case you hit it. Best advice I've ever got. Good luck with all the ground balls with your new and improved sinker. Hook them. Hook them orange.